what we're going to do now, we've uh, done our visual checks on the softener, but what we need to do is actually have a look at the water quality coming out of the softener and check it to make sure we have actually removed all that hardness. Uh, and the way we do that, uh, we use uh, chemicals here, but I know a lot of you out there will have something like this, ha uh, yes, no, hardness tablets. Word of caution with these, if you're using these, you need to uh, carefully read the manufacturer's instructions and follow them to the letter. Um, if it says take a 10 mil sample or a 20 mil sample of water, that's what you need to do. We're trying to check the water quality down to under 2 ppm of hardness. It's a very small amount. Any uh, discrepancies in water taken will have an impact on the reading. Also, with these, uh, with, with any of these chemicals, we need to make sure that everything is uh, in date. Uh, I've already prepared uh, a sample, I've rinsed everything out thoroughly before I started and I'm just going to do the actual test so you can see how easy it is to check the hardness of the water. The first thing we do is draw off 20 millilitres into a syringe accurately and put that into our test bottle uh, container. Then we take the uh, hard, hardness one, eight drops of this. And then the activator, hardness two. When we put this in, what we're expecting to happen is um, if it stays blue, then we have a soft water from our softener. If it turns pink, we've got hardness in the water. So that to me has turned slightly pink, so there's a little bit of hardness there. To be honest, I've done that on purpose. I've left a little bit of hard water in the bottom of this bottle before we started, which you may have seen. Reason being, I wanted to show you what happens if we've got hard water, how we check how much. So that means it's over two ppm. Now what I use is this uh, third solution, and every drop of this, will equate to 1 ppm. So I add that until it turns blue. And that has now turned blue at two drops. So that tells me that I've got uh, about 3 ppm of hardness in there. And that's how easy it is to check our, uh, our, the water quality coming out of the softener. Okay?